Hello YouTube, how are you doing? This is Unfollow and it's a demo that I saw a while ago and I wanted to play. It's all about losing social media followers while horrible things happen. Sort of like a mixture between sore and unfriended almost. So I'm excited to try it out and I hope you enjoy it too. So without further ado, let's dive straight in. Unfollow. I almost expected it to have, like, the Resident Evil unfollow. Be careful when you cast out your demons that you don't throw away the best of yourself. Oh, you've always been a good friend to me. The best in the world. Oh, my dear Anne. Oh, dear. I'm You're in trouble. You're not happy. I'm You're in not perfect. But don't worry. I will fix everything soon. She can fix us? You'll see. You'll be perfect. <laughs> Shh. Shh. Dear. That's mother. You don't have to speak. Everything will be all right. Oh, here it is. Soon you will feel better. Oh dear. That's that's not gonna go well at all. There's so much stuck in that, I hate to say it. Be back soon. Okay, mother, I'm gonna be back. The Princess Padme lipstick, <laughs> like the, the little lips. I was wondering why I'd seen that. Uh, monster, nice, fat, oink. Oh dear, oh dearie me. This is not good. Not good and not healthy. Followers zero. That's interesting. Okay, I'm going to be right in the way of that. So we are going to move me. We're just going to move me like this. We. Why would mother not have us strapped down? That's a great question. That's, that's a great, great question. Maybe she thinks the drugs the drugs are, are good enough. What's this? E to examine objects. Uh, medical records. Camilla Hunter. Aggressive behavior, anger management issues, high risks of harm. The patient's behavior poses a significant risk, both to herself and to others. It is crucial to closely monitor and address her behavior to ensure the safety and well-being of herself and those around her. Professional intervention and support are essential to mitigate the potential harm she causes. Uh, somebody else, Ryo Kawasaki, uh, has been diagnosed with BDD, body dysmorphic disorder. Uh, he struggles with severe dissatisfaction with his physical appearance and engages in extreme measures to alter it. He has undergone surgeries to remove his nipples and remove two ribs due to his disoriented perception of his body. Additionally, his experience is significantly distress related to perceived flaws in his facial features. Uh, date of birth was 2001 that's either a baby or I'm old I'm afraid to tell you this Bruce we are old we are old you really have done yourself stuck in a trap like a rat cool thanks user 899 uh, where, do I, where do I am I going I'm just going here uh, the patient has confronted the change, challenging consultation uh, constellation of conditions sorry including a history of severe bullying during her adolescence, resulting in a profound impact on her self-esteem and self-worth. Anna Somina uh, has received the diagnosis of bulimia nervosa. Uh, she manifests a pronounced dependency on social media platforms where she seeks validation and connection. However, this often leads to heightened feelings of isolation and anxiety. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. There's a creepy doctor right there. What is this? Uh, you, are you sure? 
Anne, are you sure that you're different from Camilla? The two of you have at least one thing in common. What could it be? Anne and Camilla. Anne and Camilla. Louise, wait, what's the different... Wait, I'm I'm losing followers. Is that like a, a serious thing? Anne and Camilla. Uh, did I just unfollow you? Oops, my finger slipped. Nerdy Netty. Uh, patient number 5469, born 2001. Patient number 1088, born 2000. March 14th, September 3rd. You have no... Oh, diagnosis date was 2019. October... I mean, that's the only, that's the only, oh wait, no, that's not, you and Camilla, that's the wrong person. I'm looking at the wrong person. Uh, Anna, June 2003, X317, uh, diagnosis date 2018. 2018, 2007, no, none of this looks like it, it matches. What's the what's the commonality here? Anne and Camilla. Anne and Camilla. Born September 3rd, 2001. June 14th, 2003. <laughs> uh, October 12th, 2019. Hey, Folklorizing 899, how you doing, man? April 8th, 2018. There's no, there's no fucking... Commonality there. There's a four digit code that I need. 2018? 2018? No. Okay. Where's my hat? Oh, I didn't wear my hat. It's, I'm not I'm wearing it for thingy um, YouTube videos. So we're just doing some YouTube videos for uh, for these games. General anxiety disorder. There's a thing. Anne. Are you sure you're that different from Camilla? The two of you have at least one thing in common. What could it be? Yawn, wake me up when this is over. God. Glad you guys aren't like this. Fucking hell. Anne and Camilla have something in common. What is it? Anne and Camilla. Camilla, Hunter. The patient's behavior poses... There's nothing else on the record. She, is it? No? Medical patient... Medical record number 5469... And Camilla is medical record number X317. Condition, self-acceptance issues, bulimia nervosa, and social media dependency. Current status ongoing. Oh, wait. That's crossed out. 317. That looks like a 5. 5317? Wait, that doesn't make any sense, though. Five four six nine and five three one seven. What? Scratched out. Oh, oh, hang on. Is there something on the back? No, there's nothing on the back. That thing just said. That person just said, uh, "Check out the thingy." Sixty nine. Nice. Uh, I'm good. I just woke up and had coffee, so it's all good. You just woke up? Fantastic. Uh, although I do have to go to work later on my late night, and, and then I get a weekend off. At least you get a weekend off. That's cool. But yeah, it's so obvious. I don't know why it's here. So fucking tell me, Acarus. <laughs> uh, follower 17. Cool. Date of birth, 2001. I need a four-digit number. It's got something to do with the medical record. I know that. Darcy Sue, the hat has been inside all of us all along. Wait, that kind of sounds wrong. It does a little bit, Darcy Sue. 5469. Oh, it's a bit juddery. I don't know if I should have put it on Epic. Something 317. Please input your medical record to get out. Wait, what? Just my medical record? 5469. Am I Anne? Was that Anne's? Five. Oh, God. Five, four. No. Five, five. Go. Five, four, six, nine. Is that it? Error. No. Oh, Anne. Oh, so that looks like a five, three, one, seven. Got it. God. Five three one seven. Is that it? 
Yeah, there we go. Lies, apparently. Lies. Oh, good. I'm glad. Oh, I got, I got more. Oh, shift to move faster. That's excellent. Crying mannequins. More mannequins. Open, to open my phone. What? Okay. The fuck is going on here? Okay, maybe I, maybe I should turn the settings down just a smidge, just to just a high, because it doesn't feel like this is well optimized. <laughs> ah, much better, lovely. Right, examine object. Uh, are you sure you're not adopted? Well, Naomi Montgomery isn't really your mother, wasn't she? That one-hit wonder singer from the nineties. She's still hot. Fantastic. Uh, I remember the day my father took this photo. Can I look at anything else? Oh god, it's still a bit choppy in open spaces. Jeez. Vsync off? Oh no, Vsync on. There we go. Do that. Much better. There we go. Uh, open door. Nope. Apparently not. Okay. I mean, I don't really want to go this way because red is scary. Oh, I have a flashlight. Excellent. What? Did I press E to apply? I think I did. Yeah, I definitely did. I'll turn that on to medium. And turn my FOV down. Just to, oh, I can see my FOV now. That's good. Turn my FOV down just a smidge. E. Can I squeeze in here? Yes, I can. This feels like um, Silent Hill, a short message. That's what this feels like. I appear to have turned it down to medium and it's gone potato vision. I'm not sure why that, why that is. I'm just going to put it back to epic. Uh, I've had a tough day today. I had a fight. Can I show, show this? I had a tough day today. I had a fight with mom again and it hurt. Why doesn't she seem to understand me? But when I met grandma, she told me the secret magic world only we knew. We talked about fairies, unicorns, and dragons. I felt so free uh, and happy. It was like nothing else mattered. Like I could do anything with my imagination. I like to think that life is magical. Like there's always a secret door somewhere ready to open up into a new amazing world I can get away to. I hope one day mom understands this too. And we can go to this beautiful magical world together. Until then, I'm thankful to have my grandma, to have grandma by my side ready to dream and fly high. Did you finish your nightmare on Phasmophobia? Yes. Yeah, we did quite a lot of Phasmo. Uh, we got to level 54 in the end, I believe. So... Uh, not quite a hundred hours, but we got to like 97 and a half, I think it was. Or, yeah, was it 97 and a half or 93 and a half? I can't remember. We've got like five or six hours left, I think. Right, so. Uh, not a lot else in here. That's fine. This has gone super weird, graphics-wise. I'm going to turn this down to 1080. It's probably not what you exactly want to be watching, to be honest with you. But I'm going to turn this down to 1080. Turn my FOV back up a bit, because I seem to be fine for it. And now resume. Okay, that looks a bit better. Not quite as fucking pixelated in the flashlight. We're all just chilling. Is that what we're doing? Oh my, what is that? Why have why have I got a red What? Why have I got a red flashlight? Yeah, so we're obviously gonna continue doing some phasophobia at some point, but right now, um we are playing some indie horror games. And this one is called Unfollow. And apparently it's linked to how many social media followers you have. So I am fucked. These mannequins might be my followers. I think, there's, I don't know, I've counted more than 21 of them. Oh, no. 
Wow, that was a really weird change of lighting. Hi, you alright? Nice picture on the floor there. I just think I am... Am I just looking for the next piece of paper to entertain my followers? Is that what I'm doing? This is this is one of those sort of like live streamed uh like horror experiences, isn't it? Is there anything here? No. No, nothing. I swear I just saw something right behind you. This <laughs> No, okay, cool. <laughs> Open. Oh, I'm locked in. Oh, unfortunate. Uh, oh. Keys. Metal key with a snake-shaped keychain. Uh, collect. And also, today's treatment. Perform surgery here. Head and upper limbs. That's about as intelligible as it gets with the doctor's notes. Head and upper limbs. Like I've got a... Oh, I see. You are a... Oh, I see. Oh, it's a laser beam. I got it. Dude, get up, back off me. Get off me. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, I'm not dead. Okay. Oh, I just get to try again. Got it. Don't no, get off me, get off me. So if you grab me, I die? That seems unfair. That seems very unfair. What what am I supposed to do? Perform surgery, head and upper limbs. Followers too? No, I need my followers to live. I'm stuck. I'm legitimately stuck. You've stopped. I look like I'm being noshed off by a mannequin. Get the fuck off me. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. <laughs> fuck. Fucking restart from checkpoint. Let's hope that checkpoint's better than the other one. Yes, the checkpoint's better than the other fucking game. <laughs> right, come here. Run! There we go. Brr. Right, cool. Do I need to do anything else to it? Is it dead? No, excellent. <laughs> this is the top tier content you're here for. Nice. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. All right, what's, can I open this door? No. It's over here. What is, oh, it's, it's just like moths slash butterflies. Good. Go to the left. Oh, this looks creepy. Denial. It's a river in Egypt. Go. Oh, it's not working. Of course it's not. <laughs> it probably needs the breaker turning on. <laughs> exit. Oh, I don't have an exit. Follow us seven. Oh, hello. Are you... Do I need to be concerned about you? Probably not. Goth, goth mommy nearly saw us. 
Are you danger? Are you a danger mannequin? No, you're fine. It took a curious. It took a weird turn. I mean, it did start with a like a a weird mommy-like figure trying to kill us. What is this? My feet deserves better. Are you okay? Jesus. Show this. Show this. Hide this. Okay. Oh. It's, it's not time to listen to the radio. Cool. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for that. Why let me listen to the radio? Why let me listen to it then? Huh? Why is it there? Wait. Is that, oh, I thought there was something else I'd done. Interact. Slide through. The fuck? What's this? This is uh, Kinrain Kin CD. Josh got this for me. I never quite understood it. I gained followers for that. Cool. <laughs> Hashtag now listening. Fuck me. <sighs> oh my god. Right. So what is through here? Oh my lord. Oh, I should go. I should go. I should leave. I should... Turn around. Bright eyes. We gotta go. Is that gonna start chasing me? No, apparently not. Can I just pick that up real quick? Spicy drunken brain. What? Preheat the oven to 180. Thoroughly wash the brain. Place the brain, chili peppers, and red wine in the oven. Bake the brain until the meat is tender and well cooked. Serve the brain with red wine and hot chili peppers and enjoy with its succulent sauce. Just quick, quick, FYI, don't eat brains. Don't eat brains. Brains contain chemicals that will kill you. Like, definitely. Like, cannibalism is a real thing that exists in the world. Don't eat brains, though. Uh, I'm going to go this way, then. Oh, more stuff? Ah, oh, no, that's the same thing. Oh, this is open now. Okay. The weird... The weird lighting change is... is oh, Lord. Oh, it's undulating. Um, the weird lighting changes. Odd. What the actual fuck? Is this related to Beetlejuice, maybe? Or the weird cephalopod game we played? I'm not 100% sure. Is this the Anything interesting over here? No. Uh... Oh, wait, wait, there's there's a there's a room back there. I can go in the room. I can get in the room. There's a paper here as well. <gasps> What's this? Uh I lost ten pounds. Finally, I can't unfollowed. You're just not that entertaining. Bye. Well, fine. Bye, Leo. Um I lost ten pounds. Finally. I can't believe I made it through the summer. It was really hard. I dreamed about food, but now no one will ever call me fat or pig again. Everyone will see how thin I am. It will be fabulous to go back to school even mom and dad were surprised they even they didn't believe i could do it they never believed in me i'm so confident now i could cry i used to get bullied horrendously for my weight horrendously what is this oh chili peppers i'm gonna make spicy brain 54 calories oh my god oh my god am i suddenly thinking of the ocean interestingly yes I crave spicy food. I don't know what all of this is. That looks delicious. Interact with the oven. I don't need to just yet. I should probably take that off. God, that looks good. Um, it's probably disgusting, though. <laughs> it's probably well gross. What is a pot washer? Good. Some meat with a knife in it. Excellent. Oh, excuse me. It's roughly the same amount of eggs I have in my week. Um, have in my fridge every week or in my cupboard every week. Uh, 
and all our noise was them. Uh, oh, red wine, 634 cal. Oh my God. So this is about body dysmorphia, this. Top notch wine from Cantina Romance, right? Yes. Yeah, sure, why not? Top notch. It's top notch stuff. Top notch is probably a term we don't use enough anymore. Uh, but, oh! Who do we have here? It's it's mother. <laughs> what is going on? What is this game? <laughs> well, she's fallen out of dead or alive volleyball. What can you say? <gasps> Undeveloped Bruce, you ate four scones with jam today. To Lovely. To be creative. To be yourself. <laughs> no. Everyone you know is making fun of you. No one cares about you, and no one will if you keep this up. Not my days. Beauty is the only thing that matters. Not true. Not true. Why did you choose to neglect it with your quirks? Don't worry. Now it's time. With a little intervention, I'll restore order. Oh, Anne, you'll understand how important it is to be obedient. Oh, yes, you will. Did, you, did they wink at me? Beauty is a gift, and obedience is the way to preserve it. No. Your eccentricity. Oh, they're blinking, but one eye is sewn open. Got it. I with my touch, I'll bestow your beauty. <laughs> oh dear. A thousand followers now. Great content, would watch again. Resubscribed. Okay, Carmilla, darling, take this thing and make sure it gets a proper cleaning. What? I part of me kind of assumed that was the end of the demo. <laughs> Apparently not. <sighs> My head. That hurt. What was that? Yep. Yeah. Did I? Did I faint? Can you faint in a nightmare? But is this really a nightmare? <laughs> I have to get out of here. <laughs> These fucking comments, man. <laughs> Find out what has been taken away from you. I mean, I don't appear to be dying, so I don't think... I mean, maybe it was something non-important? Beautiful. Oh no, that's the escape button. Sorry. Oh no, wait, that's Q? Why have Q for that? Was it interact? I'm trying to interact with it. Apparently I can't interact with it. Oh, maybe I'm interacting with it because of my followers. Nope, can't interact with it. Okay, sweet. Uh, is there anything on here that's interesting? No, nope. anything on here? No, I have 14 followers. Who is tuning into this? <laughs> Open the door. Is that where the head was? Oh, I can't go that way. Is it this way? You guys are just trying to get a soda. <laughs> Oh, you're alive, aren't you? There we go. Ha ha! <laughs> now you look like you're just praying to the others. I mean, I'm gonna wait until this winds down, this cools down a little bit, just in case this one's also a baddie. Yeah, that weird effect of the lighting changing. It looks like I don't know mold growing on the walls. It's really... Just fucking excuse me? I 
Uh uh. You weren't even subtle about that, mate. <laughs> that mannequin definitely moved. A hundred fucking percent that mannequin moved. <laughs> ah, good. What's this? Read document. There we go. Uh, oh, good. It's a comic about bullying. The whale has arrived. Hide the chips. Aren't you afraid of sinking with all that blubber? If you can, and boy, you'll empty the pool. Come on, let's see if the fatty floats. No, what are you doing to me? Leave me alone. Ah, splash. Cool. Kids are dicks. Kids are just grade A dicks. Examine object. Bold blue head, I. These greedy influences profiting from everything. Everything. No. Aki's hair always slays. Wait, that. I gained a follower for looking at hair dye. Oh, I can open this door. Good. Is something rattling in one of these? It is something in one of these. Can I crouch? A freshly cleaned brain! Pulsating and unsettling. Nice. Please be ahead. I need chili powder, chili peppers, red wine, and a brain. All of which I've got. If I only had a brain. So now I need to go back to the kitchen, right? Oh! You came out of nowhere, mate. Cheap jump scares, they're not good. Hello. Bye bye. Headshot. That's what I'd like see. Um, was that? Oh, that's something shiny over there. It's not. Any of you want to start? No. All right. Cool. That's what I thought. Um. Where was the kitchen? It wasn't in there. Oh, was it through? No, wait, was it through here? No, but I think that's where I need to use it. It definitely... Oh, no, maybe it was through here. It was through here, yeah. Oh, sorry, just get rid of that fucking thing. Are you using a sonic screwdriver to kill these mannequins? It seems kind of like you are. Are you a Time Lord? I'm, they might be. I'm not 100% certain, to be honest with you. Very little has been explained. All I know is I'm basically naked. I've got dotted lines all over me to cut out the fatty parts, even though this character is stick thin. Um, and uh, I'm making brain brain stew, I think. I'm not 100% sure. Interact with oven. Brain. How do you choose? Choose. Can't use item now? No? Red wine, that, and then brain. Bon appetit! Delicious brain, spicy, drunken brain. Beautiful. Again, don't fucking almost like a whole day's basal metabolism. I get I doubled my followers for cooking a brain. Getting ideas. You'd eat it? Don't eat it. Don't eat brains. Never eat brains, mate. They've got nasty chemicals in them! Damn it, I told you not to move! Is it possible that even something as simple as this doesn't get through that stupid little head of yours? I am gonna have to pass on this one. What is what are you doing? What are you Oh Lord? Oh, this is intentional, I see. You say this, but you've got 
undulating pulsating weak points. Oh, there's headless zombies. What is this game? What on earth is this? Yet more unrealistic body images for women. These these creepy crawlies. Unrealistic beauty standards. That's what this is. Sweet. Have you got a, a pulsaty bit? Goth mommy. There we go. I feel like we changed genre. I feel like we changed fucking games. And also generations of hardware as well. Like, it started off real, like, I don't know, atmospheric, I guess, is the word I wanted to go for. Rule of three, are you dead now? No, but you've gone real, like, pixelated. I don't know what's going on with the graphics. Like, I don't know what is going on with these graphics, but it just feels like... It feels like I'm watching a, a bad bitrate stream, but I'm playing it. You know? Like, look at your face. Like, I can't... I can barely see your face. Oh, right, well, there we go. <laughs> Anne, 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 wait. Be reasonable. I'm your mother. I'm doing all of this because I love you. You can't really think of leaving me like this. Come on, Anne. Let's try to start over. Uh, no. Accept yourself or forgive mom. And what do you accept yourself? <laughs> Cursed, ungrateful brat! You'll pay for this! I swear you'll pay! Um. Ace. <laughs> Word friend. It's the Nimbus, not the Nimbus, the Nidhog. It's the Nidhog. <laughs> Nidhog friend, hello. I got brain for you if you want it. Oh, is this? I can't move right now. I thought that everyone would have noticed my change when I went back to school with my new look. They'd been making fun of me for years. They'd make me feel like a freak. And after I starved myself for an entire summer, nobody even came to me to apologize or say something nice. Nothing. No, because they're not bullies. I'm not a freak show anymore. And now they don't see me. But they won't ignore me forever. I'm better than them. I'm special. They'll be forced to look at me. <laughs> Chapter 2, Anger. That's a million percent going to be copyrighted. That sounds like copyrighted music. That's not going... We're not doing that. We deeply care about the themes in this game. We are overwhelmed by your support. Unfollow keeps growing, and that's because of you. We would like to express our gratitude to those who believed in the project from the beginning. If you want to support us, please add this game to your wish list and spread the spread the word. It feels like a weird atmospheric detective adventure game. Some strange FPS game. Some weird. Does this some, so weird? It just seemed pretty cool though. It 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 is it is I, it's very inconsistent it does not feel like it's got a consistent message or style or direction but it feels solid i mean the fucking getting stuck on a mannequin might have been my fault to be honest with you but yeah it it just feels yeah undeveloped bruce that's really that's a good point i think there are some story elements i'm i'm missing to make this make sense maybe we didn't see all the story but then surely if there's a lot of story that has to make the story make sense, don't ask the player to go and find it. Show them the important bits and then get the player to uncover additional bits as well. Why is there a picture of someone on the toilet? Someone having a picture taken of someone on the toilet? What the fuck was that about? 
I like the theme, but I didn't understand the tentacle stuff or what the mum was trying to do. Yeah, exactly. I don't know. That's not what I thought the game was going to be, but I'll get into that in a second. But for the purposes of YouTube, I hope you've enjoyed this. Um, would you kindly follow, unfollow? Um, I hope you've enjoyed this. I had a fun time with it. It was a bit weird and a bit inconsistent, but I genuinely did have a fun time with that. I think it's a good solid demo for something coming forward i hope that whatever comes after this is going to be bigger and better um but it's it, like it's good themes good graphics good atmosphere bit rough around the edges but i had fun with it and if you try it i hope you have fun with it too but for now stay safe stay spooky and i'll see you in the next video thank you very much